We are back with the classic DTM Racing League. It is the fifth and final round. This week we are at Tokyo Expressway South Clockwise. Uh, this is brought to you by Team Oliver Racing and Philo Engineering. So after four rounds then, we've got some points for you. So Bowman is leading the way on 271. Then in second place is Mickey Moo and he is on 181 points. And in second, Fuds is in third on 152. Welly Bob is in fourth on 131. Dennis is in fifth on 126. And Jonesy is in seventh on 122 points. Rye's Tattoos is on 103 in eighth. Ricky J is on 93 points in ninth. Blackie is in tenth on 89 points. And I believe that is about it for everyone who's stayed here so far. So, yeah, it's interesting between 2nd to 6th. I think anyone could sort of take it, really. So it'll be interesting to see in these final three races what happens with these guys. So let's talk you through the grid. So it says Jonesy is in pole, but he actually didn't qualify in pole. So I don't really know what's happened here, but he's somehow at the back of the grid. But it is Rye who qualified pole, Bowman second, Blackie third, Mickey Moo fourth, Welly Bob fifth, uh, sixth, sorry, no, yes, no, third, second, third, fourth, yeah, so Welly Bob's fifth, sorry, it's confusing me because it says six, um, Gold is in seventh, Dinky Dennis is in eighth, Fuds is in ninth, Ricky J tenth, and Jonesy is technically 11th, but I don't actually know where he qualified, so I don't know what's happened there. But let's get these guys underway then. Um, 30, um, it was meant to be 10 lap races, but we ended up doing three 13 lap races, so let's get these guys underway for race 1. And we are racing in Tokyo then. So Rye gets off to oh so Bowman gets off to a good start then and moves up into first as they come through the first corner. Is everyone gonna get through here cleanly? Oh no, a tap from Mickey Boo and Ryan has lost the back end of that Supra and around they go and there were there's a lot of cars involved in that. Blackie I think Welly Bob was involved, Mickey obviously, um, Ryan was also involved, Fuds I think got through it, Ricky J definitely got through it so he's made up some positions then, Dennis got through it, so did Gold, so Gold's made up a fair few places as well, good to see him up into second, the Bowman leads then on this first lap, let's go on board then with Bowman, comes through here coming down to a big breaking zone a, a, very, a corner that's very easy to get wrong hard on the brakes then it's very easy to run wide and hit that wall on the left hand side there's another tricky corner coming up hit one curb miss the other and get on the power just a little lift for this one as Bowman then still leads starting the second lap Gold then has dropped off of Bowman but done very well to avoid all that carnage at the start as did Dennis Fuds as well from back of grid up to fourth Ricky right on Fuds then as they start lap two is Ricky gonna make a move down into here would be a great 
place to make a move if you're going to into this heavy braking zone will he try and be later on the brakes he won't he just stays behind him for the moment then Blackie trying to make up for lost time after he got caught up in that incident same with Wright got to be gutted lost his pole position off the line to Bowman and then obviously and they're coming together with Mickey Moo and they both went around so we'll be looking to make gain some places I'm sure and make up some of them points that he's lost Mickey I'm sure didn't want that accident to happen down in eight with some work to do same with Welly and with Jonesy so I think these were the guys that were affected most in that absolute um, carnage I guess we could, we'll call it <coughs> but Bowman is still out in front then another race win or two and he will surely the championship will surely be his goes fastest with a 41 dead almost as well so gold then still out in second but Dennis is right over the back of him now looking for a mistake or looking to make a move I'm sure he could get it done here if he's close enough down the inside let's see will he have a little look or is he too far back uh, it just stays behind so will he close up before the end of this straight don't know gold's got a pretty good exit Dennis going to get him uh, I think he's still just too far away uh, we'll come back to these two then Fudd's still in fourth and has dropped Ricky J then and Blackie is catching Ricky now then so oh, will Blackie get it stopped here he does then so Blackie takes fifth off of Ricky will Ricky have a look back he won't into this corner that's for sure but let's hop on board with Ricky can he keep on the back of this Cosworth in front of him there's a bit of a rocket ship in a straight line uh, it looks like He's just going to um, get away. Oh, and right. Not having a good race as he's just found Barry Art, but luckily there is no wall penalties. Otherwise, I think everyone would have about 20 to 30 seconds of penalties because it's very easy to clip a wall here. Mickey you can see right in front. Hoping for a few more of them wall taps, I'm sure, to try and get past. It looks like Rise went a bit wide there as well. <clears throat> Jonesy in 10th then, not having a good race one. Well, he has got away from him. He's a, he can see Mickey, but Mickey's a fair few seconds up the road then. So not a great race so far from Welly on race one. Oh, so Dennis must have made a mistake then because Gold's put a bit of time into him now then. So the Bowman still leads as he starts lap number five. Gold missed the carnage on lap one and is still in second. Doing a great job. Absolutely great job so far from Gold. Dennis has just dropped off a little bit, but done well to avoid the carnage as well, and is having a great race one. 
Same with Fudds. Fudds is actually catching Dennis by the looks of things, so... Fudds could soon be all over the back of Dennis. These guys both racing on controller as well, so fair play to them. And I'm not too sure about gold, whether he's got a wheel or not. But yeah, these two guys on their controllers, so fair play to them. Blackie then trying to use the speed of that Cozzy to catch up with these two guys in front. And if these two start fighting, it could happen. Ricky. Oh, he's got Rye all over the back of him. So, Ricky then, that sixth place is under threat. Is there anything he can do about the top speed of this Supra? I don't think so, as Ryan just drives past him like he's not even there then. So, he's up to sixth now. Trying to claw back some of these places after what was a devastating first lap for him. To get caught up in all of that. Ricky though, through the twisty bits, is managing to stay with him. But I should expect this Supra to say bye bye on these straights. As you can see, it's off. Mickey, uh, so now Ricky could come under threat from Mickey. Mickey's driving it like he stole it. Again, it rear end of that car out carrying some impressive speed through the twisty bit that's for sure it's eating up his rear tyres though and well he is not far behind these guys then so all oh, jonesy once you sort of battle in these cars, other people behind catch up pretty quickly. Bowman still out in front. It's coming towards the end of lap six. Comfortable race really, with all the carnage that went on behind him. Managed to get the launch off the start and pass Ryan up the inside and avoid all of that carnage so he leads gold still hanging on to that second place Dennis in third and Fudd's in fourth but he has dropped off a little bit now so he'll be open Dennis in front makes a couple of mistakes so he can catch back up to him and Blackie is hunting Fudd's down then oh just got it slowed down <laughs> right sixth Ricky yeah just dropping off a little bit now in seventh oh and Mickey doing a bit of wall riding in eighth Welly ninth Jonesy in tenth pretty lonely race for Jonesy really got him was involved in that lap one chaos and it's just sort of um, been on his own ever since you can't see Welly in front but he's a fair few seconds in front so will he catch him with six laps to go who knows there's time a mistake can happen it's very easy in these cars Fuds catching Dennis then. Big bunny hop off that curb. Done well to um, keep that on the track. Blackie, this is where this car was going to hunt these guys down in front on these straight, I say straight, straighter bits where you can really get these open up these cars 155 for 
braking for this first corner this car must struggle through these bits though it does look a handful Roy is catching slowly you can see him now so Roy keeps pushing like this he could maybe catch Blackie and Fudd's in front also what's going on here then Gold must have had a little bit of a, a mistake No, it's not going to let me but yeah I guess Gold then has made a mistake somewhere and Dennis now is hunting him down Dennis doing his best sector I thought he was going to lose that then Car did not like going over that bump As they start lap 9 then Fudds is still there as well So don't count Fudds out just yet I'm sure he'd love a podium spot I say them um, second, third, fourth and fifth in the championship is anybody so if these guys can um, get in front and get a second or get a third could get them a second or third in the championship is Blackie still catching? he is That's, it's, uh, Ra is definitely caught up with Blackie well he just a little bit behind them guys then sorry Ricky and Welly is just a little bit behind him oh so Mickey what's happened to Mickey then he's obviously had a mistake I don't know what is happening with his tyres because I mean other people have tyre wear but no, his rear tyres especially are a lot more worn than everybody else's home and then still leads as he comes through here and then through the right hander to start lap 10 in the 140s 141s pretty consistent lap times gold Dennis is right behind him then he is still in second at the moment gold that is absolutely brilliant race one from gold avoided the chaos and must have been rubbing his hands together when he found himself in second place at the end of the first lap and ever since he's been there but Dennis is now closing him down lap by lap and I'm sure would fancy that second place himself it's down ball but Dennis then see if he can get anything done after this corner very easy to get it wrong here on the brakes as well has gold no so looks like gold's got round fine as is Dennis but now Dennis getting his slipstream see if he can get past him before this next right hander gold looks like he's got a good exit himself then so I don't think Dennis is close enough on this lap here we go he's in the slip then will he get him I don't think so oh, not with that wall tap he won't so I think gold's safe at the moment but again this is a very easy corner to get wrong I think you can carry a lot more speed than you actually can and end up running out and hitting this wall on the left hand side it's very easily done and Dennis is caught right up with him here then and he is right on his rear bumper as they are about to start lap 11 Fudds 
just sitting there patiently open these two start to battle a bit more and he can close himself right up and Blackie is almost in the mix as well then so <coughs> two and a bit laps to go this could get very interesting between these guys oh and we've got a yellow flag who's the yellow flag for right okay so there was a yellow flag I'm not sure oh so for Bowman then Bowman what's happened to Bowman ah oh, so he spun it Bowman has spun it then on lap 11 gets it spun round and gets it going again so that means that Gold, Dennis and Fuds and Blackie have all caught up then uh, Gold can see him now then so this is very interesting to the last couple of laps of this race then big mistake from Bowman a healthy lead gone and all meanwhile Gold and Dennis us battling each other but also wanting to catch up with Bowman then so Fuds is there and Blackie's there Rye, I don't know if Rye's got enough laps this is a couple of laps more I think he would have got himself into the mix as well uh, and Welly is closing down Ricky J then he wants that 7th place off him Jonesy in ninth pretty lonely race for Jonesy and Mickey I think it's been a race of mistakes unfortunately for Mickey and he now finds himself down in 10th it's a Bowman then still out in front even after a mistake oh it looks like that mistake's affected him a little bit as he's just clipped the wall there and he starts lap 12 gold has managed to put a bit a, a bit of a gap in between him and Dennis oh and Fuds is looking for a move on Dennis then and this will allow Blackie to catch up with these guys now then let's see how this unfolds gold oh it's Dennis a little love tap with the wall is he going to look to be later on the brakes down into here doesn't look like it no so will he get him down using the toe you can see Bowman just ahead now big mistake from him very very nearly cost him the lead of this race in second, Dennis third, Fuds in fourth and Blackie is caught right up with these guys now so here we go as they come down into the last sector navigate this chicane through the right hand up and this is the start then of the 13th and final lap then Bowman still leads Gold in second, but Dennis now, as they start lap 13, is looking to make his move. So not going to be easy on the outside here. He's looking, is he looking for the switcheroo? Oh, would you look at that from Dennis. Beautiful bit of driving. And gets in with the old switcheroo then. So Dennis timed it to perfection. And he's now going to try and run away from these guys behind. A beautiful move from Dennis. Gold got to be fuming has had P2 in the bag since lap 1 and Dennis gets the switcheroo done on lap 13 and Fuds could also look to make his own move it's a little bit swirly out the corner but keeps it together and Blackie is there as well and this is where this Cosworth is going to be able to stretch its legs 
Could he get two for the price of one here? He is closing them down. But if they're going to be like that, then I can't see it. Core. Core, core. Oh, Blackie does, but he gives Fuds a big nudge on the way through. And, oh, Gold gives Blackie a nudge of his own. So these guys then having a proper battle. Bowman will take the race one victory then. Dennis will take P2. Gold looks like he's going to take P3. Oh, so Ryan has got past Fuds on the last lap. So, Gold will take third. Blackie fourth. Right fifth. Fuds from fourth to sixth on the last lap. Gutted for Fuds. Welly will take seventh. Ricky eighth. DDR Jonesy ninth. And Mickey Moo will take tenth place. So then, guys. Well done to Bowman. Dennis and Gold then for one, two and three the podium positions. This was race one. Catch me shortly for race two. Thanks for watching.